Hello Roll folks, it's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Roll News and Analysis. But before we start, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. Thank you. Archie Mountbatten Windsor was baptised at Windsor in 2019, at the age of two months. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may have just dropped a major hint about their daughter's christening in their Netflix docuseries Harry and Meghan, which was released in December. In the series, the couple's close friends and Hollywood producer Tyler Perry revealed that Harry and Meghan had asked him to be their daughter Lilibet Diana's godfather. While the couple has yet to confirm whether or not their daughter has been christened, Perry's comments suggest that the ceremony has already taken place. In the documentary, Perry recalled receiving a phone call from the couple where they asked him to be their daughter's godfather. I take a minute to take that in and I thought I'd be honoured. I'd absolutely be honoured, he said. Perry also revealed that he asked the couple if they could do a private ceremony for their daughter, rather than having a church ceremony with all the formalities. Maybe we can do a little private ceremony here and let that be that, and if you have to do it there, then it's okay, he said. The couple has not confirmed where their daughter will be christened, but sources suggest that they are likely to opt for a US-based ceremony. Last summer, there were reports that the couple wanted Lilibet to be christened at St. George's Chapel in Windsor, where they got married and where their first child Archie was christened. However, the couple's spokesperson responded to the report by saying that the plans for the baby's christening have not been finalised, and as such, any assumptions about what will or will not take place are mere speculation. It's also unclear whether or not the couple has already held a christening for their daughter, but many royal watchers believe that it may have taken place during their visit to the UK for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. However, there has been no official update from the couple's spokesperson. Perry also spoke about his friendship with the couple in the Netflix documentary, revealing that he reached out to Meghan before the couple's wedding in 2018. He had seen negative stories about her father, Thomas Markle, and wanted to offer his support. I found it to be hurtful. If he were my father, Perry said, he also spoke about offering the couple his multi-million dollar Beverly Hills mansion as a place to stay in the US after they announced their role exit in 2020. As for Lilibet's christening, royal biographer and editor of Majesty magazine Ingrid Seward suggests that if the ceremony does happen in California, there may not be an official announcement. They'll have their own Vogue cameraman there. There will definitely be photos, but they may not be released. She said, the couple's first child, Archie, was christened in July 2019 when the couple were still working members of the Roth family and living in the UK. Archie's christening was held at Windsor with the family including King Charles III and the Prince and Princess of Wales all in attendance. While the world waits for confirmation of Lilibet's christening, it's clear that the couple is committed to raising their children in their own way, away from the pressures of royal life. So what do you guys think about the comments? Let us know, and we'll be back soon with more royal news and analysis.